Happy Healed sandal called the Liba. Now this is one of those times where we're going to go to .com a lot because depending on the color, and there's two, um, completely changes the look. So this one is your solid because there's going to be one with snake in a minute. If you want this particular one, we are calling it almond, toasted almond. I still have to tell you about the croissant I had today, speaking of toasted almond. I'll get there in a minute. So all this beautiful almond colored leather, and then your stone detail from pinks to mauves to hot pink to beautiful golden color to yellow choices to all of those beautiful kind of jade like colors. It's a multicolored shoe on an almond leather, and then it's got that beautiful high three and three sevenths of an inch wood blocked heel. Now there's another one, totally different. Same silhouette, but totally different color vibe. So Krista, thank you. Black and white is referring to snake in this instance. That is not just a black and white shoe, that's a black white snake shoe. And then I'm hoping, I don't know, are there any better pictures where you really see the front of the shoe? What about going down below and clicking on that other picture? See there's the video? Yes, yes! If every night of my career was like this, you guys, I would just be happy. I would, not that I'm never unhappy, but like, thank you. That is amazing. I'm never working with anybody else but the people I'm working with tonight. So look at this black and white snake. It's got the gold color option as well. None of them had silver hardware on it. I hope you weren't hoping that that was the case. I mix and match my metals. Probably why I love this ring so much. I've got platinum over here, rose over there. So I like that it's, they both have the gold metal and then you can do your silver earrings. It doesn't matter. That one has turquoise in it. I know, really pretty, right? And then that big, beautiful piece of pink in the middle. Do you like Auburn? Because that one also has a little bit of Auburn in it. They're all gorgeous. You just decide what you like best. Um, but here's the design. So that's a, a, a big heel, right? Three and three sevens. So I'm gonna turn it over, sorry, so that you can see, oh, that's a chunkier heel. That's not your stiletto. And you know, clearly we host have shared this and worn this style before. So don't look too much at the, uh, of the underneath. Yours will be never worn by any of us. Um, like a cage, right? Just climbing up the foot. You'll have your little toes peeking out with a fresh color. I dot, got my pedicure yesterday. I did purple, not doing it again. Purple did not work for me. I'm gonna keep it on there. I, I don't wanna waste my money and go back just for a polish change. So maybe we're, we're doing red toenails. I see a lot of people doing hot pink toenails. Maybe white toenails. So whatever toenails you're doing, basically they're peeking out, you're looking glam. This is gonna go around your ankle. You're gonna adjust it the way you would adjust your belt. And then you've got this awesome shoe on that you've got for $60 when it should have been $150. That's a good discount. That's the biggest savings in the show. It just dawned on me. That's $90 less than what we originally brought the shoe in for. There is nothing else in the show with a bigger discount than this shoe. Side stitch coming up, my pants, mm, the side stitch shirt. Maybe they too will have a huge savings, but this is the winner, you guys. The biggest savings in the show. $12 easy pay, free shipping and handling. Back to .com we go, because it's not just about the almond leather from Louise at sea. It's about the black and white, that's that snake. You know what I would do with that? And again, I always say, let me go in one ear and out the other if you are not feeling my suggestions. Everybody's different. You know, you can wear swan dresses to award ceremonies this day of age. Granted, that was decades ago, but you get the point. Everybody does what they wanna do now, and that's why I love this world we live in, as far as fashion goes. So if you are not feeling what I'm suggesting, again, Basic colors, do you have a little black maxi dress? Get that black and white shoe. I know a solid black shoe would work with a solid black maxi dress, but that's gonna make it look 10 times cooler, 10 times fiercer. What about denim shorts? Kim Gravel, she did that denim Bermuda short a few weeks ago, did you buy it? All right, fine. Did you buy a logo Bermuda short this year? An Isaac Mizrahi crop pant, capri pant, etc. Basic colors need a little bit more fun a little bit more, ah, when wearing them. Maybe the embroidered shirt from Kim Gravel, a quiet, subtle shoe, because you've got more of an overpowering shirt. But a basic color, mmm, look at what that does, right? Almond, toasted almond, I knew I forgot a word. Toasted almond, I'm gonna cough. <coughs> and then the black and white is black and white snake.
My team, I'm not leaving you. I'm just looking for my Starbucks, AKA my water. Oh, Teresa, don't run, it's okay. I probably shouldn't drink water anyway, but I need to, thank you. All right, it's time for Side Stitch. How